Hi everyone, welcome to yet another episode of Not Too Young to Invest. You're not too young to invest in real estate. And today we're going to have, trust me, an amazing, amazing conversation because I have a mover and shaker in the interior <laughs> and lifestyle space. Please join me as I welcome Mrs. Moranike Molen, the CEO of Orkantik Interiors. <laughs> so you don't hype yourself. You, you don't hype you. You hype yourself. I, I have to hype you. <laughs> My CEO. Oh, thank you so much really for having nice me. It's really nice to have you. Mo. Thank, thank you. Thank you for you. coming on our show to <laughs> share you. your story. Thank you. Thank you know, you. when we started this campaign, I I looked back and I said, I need to connect with those people who have done this mm. and can show others that mm. it is possible mm. Mm. and mm. i am so proud of you thank i'm sure you, you know that thank you and today mm. we really just want you to um, share your authentic story mm. on how you you know started this journey mm. but before we you know we go into that i'd like to say oh we see the amazing things <laughs> that you're doing in the interior thank and lifestyle thank space. you man. thank you and man. um how did this journey start mm. you know did it eventually lead the path to real estate mm -hmm. how did you come into mm -hmm. real estate investing mm -hmm. you're very young mm -hmm. a lot of young women mm -hmm. are not you know thinking first to invest mm -hmm. in real estate there's so many questions I want yeah to ask. i know I okay know. let's okay. let's start from the basics <laughs> all right no problem. Yeah. thank yeah. you so much for, for having me again and i'm so so grateful to be here um so i'll say that my investment journey started with myself and my husband right um so when we just got married right uh, if my husband is you know just people that they plan five years from now 10 years 20 year ah. goals they're already writing it and i'm like please can i just wake up tomorrow morning like this structured, this structured, man. structured man do you understand <laughs> so by year three he was already saying you know we need to start getting needs to get our property because mm -hmm. at the time we're living at 1004 and he was saying that you know paying rent of four million dollars per year at that time and this was like 12 years ago and it's like the money like how do we 12 years 12 ago, years ago yeah, exactly. old. <laughs> <We're> old. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness and so he was like if we're paying this amount of money imagine paying four million for 10 years that's already 40 million you might as well have bought your own house at the time and then of course it's not yes stone. yes it's not as exactly you know, it's not changing, as exactly yes. exactly so we sat down and i was like ha okay we cannot even afford any house at the moment uh, how do you want us to do it but i think that's the power of you know sitting down and saying that this is my goal this is my vision i want to do it in fact if you don't think about it most like often than not you will not even be able to achieve or actualize it so we sat down and we looked at it and within like space of six months uh, we got we saw a house that was starting like off plan and they said you know pay this amount of money and i think at the time it was five million so the house itself off plan was 33 million at the time mm -hmm. so they said we should pay five million that five million dollars self we're like how are we going to find this money but somehow somehow we're able to get it and um we paid for it and then we're not supposed to be paying it per month for the next two years now anyways long story short is that eventually even though we did not meet up sometimes you know mm -hmm. young family you know my husband nine to five my business was just starting at the same time so monies that you know would come into our hands instead of doing using it for other things that were flimsy at the time we knew that we had a goal and so we would always channel it into that and that's how we were able to do it so once we did that i was like oh okay this is doable um and so you know at the back of my mind i also wanted to invest but at the time because i wasn't i was so afraid of like investing in you know in nigeria you hear of stories if it's not one scam somewhere people call your money or somebody run away your, your, your money or, or they you know what that, 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 that you, you, know, you <laughs> get or they'll say okay oh, this developer you know say they will complete in six months three years we are still on it and so i'm like ah, i don't know let me just be putting my monies in mutual funds and like euro bonds so so that's what i was just doing until I was speaking to someone that I really respect so much. Her name is um, Tommy Balogun. Hey, Tommy! <laughs> <laughs> and so at the time, I was like, okay, I'm gathering this money. I'm gathering this money. So I'm thinking maybe I should go and buy land in a fair side and everything. Like, what do you think? And she's someone that, you know, I really value her opinion. You know, her opinion. And mm -hmm. she said, okay, maybe for now, instead of buying land and all of that and all that trouble, why don't you buy, like, property and you know you can even be making rental income from it and all that that's like hey where would i where which which developer do i want to trust to go and i should say ah 
say no more. Victoria Crest Homes, like they are trusted. They are people that you know have seen their track record. Brand ambassador. I, know. <laughs> I was like, okay, okay, no problem. You speak highly of them, and mm -hmm. me, I value your opinion. And at mm -hmm. the time, I didn't talk, used to talk to you. I just knew you as CEO of Lagos of Instagram. Instagram, I was like, ah, mover and shaker in this real estate. But you know, um, so what she said, I was like, okay, no problem, that's fine. And she said, it, and a month after. Right, I think I met you at an event, yes. and you know I came up and introduced myself to you. Yes. And but we didn't were, even speak, we didn't for, speak for long. You know, but then, even though you didn't know me, nothing like you were so gracious. You know, you spoke to me nicely, and then handed me over to your PA and all that. But I knew that I would try to do business somehow with you. And a month after, your PA reached out to me and said, ah, "There is this Valentine promo, and um, even though we've passed it like two days, I can speak to Madam CEO to see if you can still key into it." Mm. And it was February, you know, it was March 3rd or so because it was mm. a Valentine promo. Mm. I said, okay, no problem. Like, how much is the down payment? I think the down payment I said was like 20 M at the time, also because the property was 45 mm. million. I was like, ha, 20. So for, for it to be 20 million, we had gone past. Yes, the yes, 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 gone, day, yes, yes, so yes, yes. We probably yes. had like six months. Yes, left yes, yes, exactly. Yes. So I said, for us ha. to be doing like yes, 50%. Yes, yes, yes. So I told her that, okay, you know what, please let me just speak to my husband. Because my husband and I, you know, we bounce things off together before we do anything so even small things not to talk about a major investment like this and was like okay if you think that you know you've done your due diligence and you've done your own work and you feel like yeah, go for it and i said okay no problem so the next day and as god will have it and this thing about like when you just think about ah, starting a vision like the universe just begins to align Line and so i think that we had like a major project that we had been chasing for some months and it just clicked mm -hmm. and so immediately I just you know and so I have like um, a policy where we sweep you know profits you already calculate the profits of the mm -hmm. project before mm -hmm. you even start so that you mm -hmm. don't start spending anyhow mm -hmm. sweep it into investment and so I said you know what this one let's so that's how I just diverted that money into paying for the down payment and I said okay if you pay the down payment at least I know that I will not be in the situation by CEO say come and collect your money back or you are not paying your installment so and so every month I was not supposed to be paying like 4 m every month and I just know that month one that, and two at that time did you know um, it's not like you were any eh, salary eh, not like, how did no, you I, know like that you could pay that I just, was the money I just to come had from? faith that you know what I've done this and God see look I'm going to work hard and there's just something about it that like you just work hard your brain starts calculating okay do I need to market more you know maybe before I'm just shy of asking people that oh tell me people that oh yeah, I know part of you know what I was telling <laughs> I'm shy I'm <laughs> shy come out and know, talk come out so, so I was like eh who's, who does shy help no mm. like, 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 so mm. normally maybe I would not speak up. Your bills are not shy. They are not shy. Oh, mm -hmm. they are not shy. So normally maybe before I would just keep quiet and say let the come, let the business come. come to you. At this time I was going out to the and business, to looking, the for the looking for the business. And you know if you talk to ten people, at least even if one or two people, you know that at least it was, it was better than. You nothing. know you're giving us a marketing masterclass. <laughs> I guess. And so that's how you know I was pushing myself. I was thinking creatively. How do I? How do we make more money to do this? And month one, month two, month three. By the end of six months. And when your PA reached out to me and said, this is your final bill. I think I shed a tear and I was like, even now thinking about it, I'm having like oh. goosebumps thinking about it. Okay, oh let's just say <laughs> Like, oh my goodness and then my husband said i'm proud of you oh, and i was just like so oh my sweet. goodness you know so i called my parents did you too. cry i cried though why oh, would i, I cry? not cry <laughs> hey god you know what it means i know i, had to well, I was about to say i'm so proud, proud of, of you, you right and so i called my my mom and my dad as mm. well told them that this is what i've done and you know so you didn't proud. tell them initially mm -mm, i didn't tell them. i needed to complete it first <laughs> that was my target um, and then my dad built his first house uh, when he was 40 mm. right and so me i was doing this at um i was still 33, 33 no 32. i never turned 33 that last year you i was 32, 32. Mm. so you know he was extreme okay no by the time i finished paying right, i was yeah. already 33 but you started at, yeah, 32. Started, started at 32 mm. yeah so he was like you know I'm, I'm you know they were proud of me and all of that and then i just said okay thank you thank god and then that was how you know it happened even till today like i still pinch myself that ah this happened because right? there are women men mm -hmm, mm -hmm. who are 
40, mm -hmm. beyond 40, mm -hmm. um, 35, mm -hmm. who are not even thinking mm -hmm. not, of, not to stop of owning mm -hmm. theirs. And, and this is not to spite them or anything. Yeah. No, no, it's no. just to inspire, inspire them to say yeah. that mm -hmm. if Morike can do it mm -hmm. at 32, mm -hmm. then I ain't got nothing <laughs> stopping me. <laughs> yes, so, yes, yes. Um, so, so how... You know how was this journey mm, like mm, truly mm. someone listening to you now will say oh it was easy for her because you know she's an interior person she was getting jobs mm. and you know she could divert her money like she said to doing her repayments mm, mm. so for someone who doesn't have that mm. liberty mm. or that leverage mm, mm. What, what can they do? Mm. How can they achieve this? Mm. So interestingly, last year was even the year where business was actually even down. Slow. Was or let me say, let me use the word slow. The year, if it was the year earlier, what I was just doing, like I said, I will convert monies from naira into dollars mm -hmm. just to preserve the currency, the value. the value, and all that. And then I'll just put it in mutual funds or like euro bonds. Mm -hmm. Which you know, if you look at it actually vis a vis with the real estate, I think that the real estate return on investment is actually even better, mm -hmm. right? Um, but then again, it doesn't, doesn't hurt to also earn in dollars as well. So mm -hmm. I was doing that um, but then last year when things were slow I still believe that it was still going to work out but I'm grateful that there was the payment plan because if you had asked me to drop the money at once I think that's where there might not be problem mm. my wife. there will be problem <laughs> <laughs> there will be problem and I won't want to go and you know start removing monies from you know what I was you were already, um, doing. I was already doing so mm. I wanted to do this one like fresh like mm. I know that okay I started this project so you're still doing your yes your yes mutual funds and cool books. yes yes but I still wanted to compared, to compared to yes compared yes. to you mm. I think you've already said mm -hmm. it but maybe just to re-echo it mm -hmm. compared to mutual funds mm -hmm. and you know investing in mutual funds mm -hmm. and all the mm -hmm. new bonds mm -hmm. and, cool, mm -hmm. and the real estate because mm -hmm. you have started doing yes. real estate yes. investing yes. now yes. Yes. you know what is it like for you what which is you know of higher volume mm. which gives you more security mm -hmm. than the other mm. so to be honest i would say that um I would say so at the maybe because I'm, I've just like started this real estate journey mm. right and then the other one I've done it like two like three years mm. now um, so I would say that at the moment it's still like they're almost like at this on the same level for mm. me mm. right but I know that as I progressively grow but the great thing about this real estate is that I can actually buy a property today and tomorrow he has five million. On he top. already had, exactly, and you don't get that. Like with my own, um, like with my mutual fund and euro bonds, there is there are there's days progression. there's progression. So mm -hmm. once in six months, mm -hmm. you get like you know your coupon money mm -hmm. into your account. So it's, mm -hmm. it's cast in stone. Mm -hmm. But real estate, you can actually somebody can actually say, I have so so amount of money. I'm in this stress. I want to buy. You know, please let me buy from this. Mm -hmm. Or you just appreciate. When right? I realize that okay, between the time I finish paying and now, which is not even up to a year mm. you know um it, it, we are almost like talking about like another eight million on top of the it's more it's more exactly and then for my um mutual funds and this thing it's not i, I haven't seen that in a year mm. maybe that amount i'll see it in like two or two and a half years even okay. though i'm earning in dollars mm. but so so I, I think that i've answered that question now because yeah. it feels like it's the real estate that is actually that <laughs> actually even pays you more yeah. i think the difference is just in my head because i'm getting Naira. FX. FX, yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's why. But if we then convert it, actually, mm -hmm. the real estate one um, is, is more. Amazing. Okay, so um, obviously you got a bit of guidance mm -hmm. with speaking to Tumi Balogun mm -hmm. and identifying the right real estate company to mm -hmm. work with. Mm -hmm. And that has helped, mm -hmm. you know, your journey so far in the real estate space. Um, for those people who probably don't have that, mm -hmm. what, what should they do mm -hmm. differently? Mm -hmm. But yeah. I believe that mm -hmm. there are some people who um, will still watch this and mm -hmm. will say, ah, it was easy for her because mm -hmm. she had to mm -hmm. um, or I don't know anybody that I can mm -hmm. talk to. Mm -hmm. How can I start? Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So I think who can that, teach you? Yes. And this video might mm -hmm. not teach you everything mm -hmm. you need to learn. Yes, yes, yes. So, yes. so I think that it's even easier. If you're watching this already, you already know that if you're not following CEO, like what are you doing with your life? What are you actually doing? How do you want to start with? Do you understand? So, <laughs> oh, so for me, I would say, that, and I think that that's very key and very important because you guys have built a solid track record so yeah. i'm up for patterns i'm up for track records like 
if you come to me and you tell me that you're just starting something last year, mm -hmm. I will be weary because you don't have the experience. You, I, I don't see. I don't know how when you fail, how you you haven't tested, you haven't tested, not tested, you're not and, tested and trusted. Mm -hmm. You get that you guys have done this over and over and in big, large skills. And you guys will say that you would complete a project in eight months. You're finishing it in like six months or even less, right? Where, yeah, whereas, that's what happened. Yeah, yeah, that's projects. what happened. Because when they told me, I was like, they said, oh, your key and um, your uh, allocation. Can you? I said, <laughs> have we gotten there yet? <laughs> they told me that it yeah, was like see, October, October, October yes. or so, and, and then by, ahead of I think time. around July or so. Yes. I, was, I was like, wow. I was like, ah, okay. I'm not me. I'm not yet ready. You are faster <laughs> than me. Oh. I'm We're not ready to collect. Me. I'm not ready to collect my key. <laughs> Do you see? So, so that's. I think that that's amazing because you. And that's one thing that Tommy told me. Mm. So it was a. It was a. It was a, something of oh. I was told yes, and it actually and it happened, happened you. right? Mm. So if you're watching this, to be honest, and it's not like, oh, because I know you mm. and all of that. It's you did not know me when you bought your property. <laughs> exactly. I did not know you, you when I knew you. Yeah, when I bought the your property. Yes, that actually, mm. actually, that's true. Mm. Um, and it was just that, like, he was just so, it's confident. Like, my, my husband, right, would say, oh, don't put all your eggs in one basket. basket. So yeah. he's kind of person. I'll say, okay, you bought from Victoria Crest now, buy from under that place, just in case if anything happened. But I would say with my full chest, 100%, I can actually put all my eggs in, in one basket. In one basket. John, I said, with Victoria Crest. I know that. You are a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Who helped me in my life. <laughs> sort of. Somehow, some. Last, last, I'll come and collect a yeah. Nicole's room or something. Do you understand? Don't it it should never, it should never happen. Do you see? Yeah. So, so for me, I would say that that's that's an assurance um, for me and if you are thinking about it okay i don't have you know money how do i start i don't have like, again like i said thankfully you guys do payment, payment plans. plans and their mortgage and their mortgage opportunities, opportunities right so and you know like the other day when i was having a discussion with you and your husband and was saying that if you invest in your that's estate true. yeah, it made you buy that yeah. House yes and it made me <laughs> <laughs> so that's like another thing right i was just on my own no i was on my own and doctor says i have an offer for you i say hi doctor i came here for another we came here for another thing i have been telling you to come and buy that out <laughs> and, but you can say yeah. let's just let's put just finish one. Just let's, 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 let me let me drink. Uh, let me let keep me drink up, water. I keep, I keep cup first. But then doctor gave me an offer that I could not resist. Right? And I said, pay this amount of money and then spread it over one year. I say, ah. When well, Nikkei told me, guys, that she cannot do, she will not do one year. That we'll she's do, pushing herself to, to do, do six, six months. months. Yes, then like, you need to just push yourself. My jaw dropped. I had to turn back. I was sitting in front. I had to turn back to look at her like. Okay. Because yeah, if not, you just relax and just think, you know, one year. And before you know it, it's like just do six months. Because I don't know, six months, you don't know another. Maybe that doctor will be in a great mood again and say, I have another one for you. I say, let's talk about it, you know. But then again, just in case, it's not like he's dashing me money or anything. It's just like, do it's just encouraging you, and yes. pushing. And because you see that I'm a young that you can do it. And I can do it yes. exactly. Yes. So, so thankfully, you know, I'm on my second one. And immediately that occurred. I just told myself that wow if i did one last year and i'm doing one this, this year, year i might as well just commit and the mindset thing i might as well just commit to doing one every, every at least one every year you know when i sent I my think I've pushed it to yes two. yes in fact, when i sent my receipts to doctor right that ah, i've already made the down payment mm. too and i was like and i just and i just said cheers to 50 more yeah. right um yes <laughs> Job. Yeah, so, so. Job <laughs> so I just like chess and at that time I wasn't even thinking about I'd not even thought about the one or at least one one in a year. Mm. So if I'm saying chess to fifty, who knows man in ten years time now, that's how yep, I'll just yep, yep. You people be mad begging me that I should come and you know sell one of my properties <laughs> to you people so you can sell to another person. We'll come to that okay, conversation. Mama. Okay. We'll come to that mm -hmm, conversation. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'm going to ask mm -hmm. now, you know, since you started mm -hmm. actively investing mm -hmm. in real estate, mm -hmm. how has your financial you know life been? Mm -hmm. Are your finances now better planned? Mm -hmm. Are you able to you know? do those things that you ordinarily wouldn't mm -hmm. have been able to do mm -hmm. now because mm -hmm. you have investments mm -hmm. that can pay mm -hmm. for it mm -hmm. so yeah so this is an interesting question because before now i say i'll say like in the last 10 years i'm just people that by january you know i'm doing like vision board this is what i want to achieve this is what i want to achieve but some for for some reason i haven't had like 
serious financial goals, personal financial goals. For the company, yes, because we won't sit down, we do retreats, you know, strategize for the year, what, we, what, our, what our revenue, projected revenue will be and all that. But individually, mm. I didn't really have that. So as I was saying, that last year, you had told me in January, that by the end of the year, yeah, I, would, I would have had, house. I would have said, I won't have, even, because I didn't think about it. My was just, let the money be coming, mm. I'll be, you, you continue, know, with, continue what well with what I was doing and all mm. of that. But now, I've now sat down and I'm like, okay, you know what, this money would come. Instead of me just acquiring cash, acquiring cash, because for me, that was all that I was just thinking about, cash, just accumulating cash. You know what, why don't you allow this cash? To work for you, you know those um, aspire to aspire. They say, "Let your money be working no, for you yes, while you sleep true, and all of that." True. So, for that's, like which that's all the songs that they are does. saying like mm -hmm. this. Okay, no problem. But now, like actually, a reality. You don't want a situation where by all you're just thinking about is the money that comes in at the end of the month because mm -hmm. of your salary or work. Mm -hmm. You want that? Okay, you can just be having lunch with your friends and you just see a lot and you're like, "Oh, where's oh." oh. Is this investment that I like that kind of lifestyle? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just yeah, yes, I know that one just come back. I'm so oh, the one I did that sit up. Oh, ah, which one is coming in again? Though? You say I know ah. exactly. Oh, oh, okay, this one has got you the hotel road mm. ahead. Do you understand? So it's so so that's like the beauty about like investing and making like your money work for you. So this property that I've gotten now, I want to use it for Airbnb, right? So again, only God knows how, you know, that also would then open, you know, other opportunities oh, for somebody, for right? But you just have to start. It mm. might seem extremely difficult at the beginning. It always mm. seems difficult to, mm. if it's not even difficult, you need to run mm -hmm. because it is too easy. So once you just start, when you commit to starting, right, um, just coming to like a company like Victoria Crest where you pace you, they are, you are allowed to pace yourself and then you just commit to it and you realize that you'll be able to um, okay so I'm going to go a bit more personal mm -hmm. now um, so a few things a lot of young women mm -hmm. usually are skeptical mm -hmm. the unmarried ones especially mm -hmm. and maybe a bit a few of them a couple of them are mm -hmm. beginning to wake up to the fact that you don't necessarily need to wait for mm -hmm. a husband mm -hmm. to own your property mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so but we still have a, a couple who think that only the property will intimidate mm -hmm. whoever mm -hmm. comes mm -hmm. seeking their hand mm -hmm. in marriage mm -hmm. so what would you say to that that's mm -hmm. one secondly you you know, decided that you wanted to start doing real estate mm -hmm. investments. Mm -hmm. How did that work out, mm -hmm. you know, at your home front? Mm -hmm. How did you handle it with your mm -hmm. husband? Mm -hmm. You know, you are a married woman and a lot of married women have the concerns of, oh, who will, who will I put <laughs> whose name, name, name will the yeah. property mm -hmm. be in? Mm -hmm. You know, did you have those mm -hmm. issues? Mm -hmm. How were you able to handle mm -hmm. it? Mm -hmm. Whose name is yeah, the is property, property yeah. going to be yeah. in? Mm -hmm. It's usually a major, major concern, concern mm -hmm. for married women. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. because of that, most of them don't mm. want they rather go and buy gold, mm. travel the world, wear designer bags mm. and shoes, mm. so that you don't have to you deal do with that. Uh, you yeah. want to have support authority. Mm. You know, because once you start buying property, you feel like you are now, um, you have arrived. So when the man, they the lion, the emperor, the conqueror. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah. Yeah. Okay. So the first question, I would say, as a young girl, like if you are not married, don't even think about oh, you know, my husband would be. Especially when the person has not even arrived, mm -hmm. right? Um, don't even do. What if you even get married to somebody that is even has bought ten houses? You never can tell. Um, that's one. So you have to just be an addition. Yes, yeah, just to just be an addition, right? Um, so do you and, and at that time you have the liberty of putting it in your name. Exactly. So there's no exactly. question of, no, the question whose, of whose name, name should, it should it be. Exactly. So if my younger sister, right, um, I would advise her that she should, if she has the funds, she should buy the property in her mm. name. And a man that wants to be intimidated will be intimidated. Whether you have, you don't you have, have you'll be intimidated. And strong men that know that okay this is actually an addition to me mm -hmm. as well mm -hmm. even whether it's in my name or not in my name mm -hmm. fantastic right and there are lots of men like yeah. that outside mm -hmm. so it's just it's fine i think i feel like it's also like a a, a matrix to also know that okay this person i should run from this person mm -hmm. or not so i would advise now going to my own personal um, um experience, experience. so mm -hmm. like i mentioned I told my, in fact, you know, because I didn't even have time to be thinking, you know, ah, we need I, to pay, pay yes. today, or if mm. I, the, it will, the offer will leave the table. Mm. And he said, oh, sure, go ahead and buy, right? Um, and whose name, in whose name should it be? And he said, 
put it in your name, right? You, are, you, are you actually asked him. Yes, yes, yes. Put this in your name because for me, I would just say uh, Mr. and Mrs. But if I've heard before that they said, don't be putting Mr. Mr. and Mrs. your son name. Mr. Because Mr. Joseph, Joseph, Joseph and Mrs. Mrs. Kemi. So, 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 and so. Yes. Right. My friend is actually Kemi Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> Kemi Joseph. Kemi Joseph. Oh, yeah, come, 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 let me come give you a <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, um, so I told him and he said yes, you know, write it in your name. But when you were buying our own, like where we are living now, I say no, it must be in <laughs> Mr. Um yeah and, and Mr. 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 Abai and, me and Mrs. Moreni Kemole. Yes. Yeah. So my mother was gracious enough. He said, no there. problem. But for, with mine, he said, no, 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 you know, you can actually put no, it like in your name. like you said earlier, mm -hmm. a strong man mm -hmm. knows it's an addition. Mm -hmm. he, he's not threatened by mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Because he knows that if you have that, it's, you know, it's a yeah, plus, it's a plus, plus for family. the family. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you doing yours consistently mm -hmm. would say, also, would make yeah. him yeah. think, mm -hmm. okay, we mm -hmm. need to ask, actually do more mm -hmm. for the family. Yeah, yeah. So, so but I, but personally, I think I'm indifferent, mm -hmm. right? Whether it's in, is, in, in our Mr. both names or, or in my, he's also indifferent, mm -hmm. right? Um, so it wasn't really, it, was, it wasn't a, we didn't have any like issues about it. However, like I would say that each family is um is unique. Is unique. So you you need to be able to understand. But I would still say that it's either it's in the woman's name or in both. But not that as a woman, mm -hmm. your husband is saying that it must be in his, his own name. name. Yeah, but for you, who is buying? Who is bringing mm -hmm. the money? Mm -hmm. No, that shouldn't. Be. That's what I'm saying now. Yeah. That if it's the woman that is. No, if, if both of you are doing an investment yes, together, yes, that's, yes, fine. Fine, that's fine. Mr. A and, and Mrs. Mrs. B, B yeah. um, whatever your yes, surname is. Yes. Then if he's buying mm -hmm. on his own mm -hmm. and decides, okay, he wants to do it in his yes, name, yes. the same way you have way. liberty to mm -hmm. do it in your name, mm -hmm. he also has, has the liberty, liberty to do it. And but what I'm saying is that if he's the imagine is a woman that is buying mm. or that is paying yeah but the man is insisting that it must be in his, his own name, name alone no, no, that's then that's fair. exactly that's mm. not fair so that's what mm. i'm saying that you need to also check that out what, um, and i feel like sometimes that's why maybe some women will not be hiding yeah and but i think there are conversations that need to start yes early, early, even yes before, before you know the investment time comes, comes so yeah. if he's not open to it mm -hmm. it's not a fussy thing mm -hmm. you just start introducing it mm -hmm. talking about it mm -hmm. you know maybe find people who can you know also also yeah you know the having the right people around you and that's why it's important to plant yourself mm -hmm. in the midst of good people because mm -hmm. that's how you have been yes, introduced yes, yes, to yes, real estate yes, yes, apart yeah. from the fact that you had done it with your husband you were struggling with who to go to mm -hmm. when you were ready mm -hmm. to buy mm -hmm. but because um Tommy was there yes, to, yes, yes, you know, yes, to, to guide to you. guide me, yes. You were able yes, to take able that to decision. Do that. True, so if true. he has people, the right people, mm -hmm. and you can connect with those right people as his wife, mm -hmm. then that, that would be fine. You know, that would really help. Amazing. Ah, amazing. We had a really, a really interesting conversation today. And um, I cannot overemphasize the mm. fact that a lot of women need to take up mm. you know mm. real estate opportunities mm. and invest we mm. still have a lot of women mm. who do not have mm. their first property mm. and they are in their late 30s mm. they're in their 40s mm. they're in their 50s mm. and a lot of them are listening to you today and most of them their fears are some of the things we've talked mm -hmm. about mm -hmm could be finance it could be the fact that they don't have access to the mm -hmm. money mm -hmm. it could be the fact that um, they don't want um, to scare any man mm -hmm. away mm -hmm. because they, they they believe that it should be their husband mm -hmm. who should buy mm -hmm. and if they are the ones buying mm -hmm. it means they will not get the right mm -hmm. man because mm -hmm. they will be too high priced mm -hmm. so to speak for the man mm -hmm. and then it could also be that those who are married are having these issues mm -hmm, of mm -hmm. whose name or mm -hmm. whose name <laughs> or who not mm. should you know there are so many reasons why a lot of women mm -hmm. are not investing in real estate so mm -hmm. what would you say mm -hmm. you know to these women speaking to most of these challenges that i have pointed out mm. what would your advice be so i think before i even come to that advice i wanted to just even mention that so for me i'm an advocate for once there is a will there would always be a way just first think about it you can start plan a plan b plan up to better before you get to plan z 
something will show forth so if you're and this is for people that are not even married like young girls who just i just listen to this i say ah it's for people that have started mm -hmm. and all that you know there's also the possibility so we, we're of taking it from not too young to, to a bit to, of more of women yes and, yes and yes i am doing that deliberately mm -hmm, because mm -hmm, you are young mm -hmm, you're married mm -hmm, you're a woman yeah, so woman, it speaks yeah. to, to yes like, that demographic almost, yes. yes so i would say that there's also the option you can think about it and say are there three other women like me that I trust and we can come together right put money we are not going not that we're going to live in it we're actually buying it for, for investment, investment purposes so if a property is 40 million naira, instead of thinking in your in your head ah I will I afford 40 million naira, and you already know that down payment is maybe like 10 million for example okay the four of us can we bring two two million or 2.5 million naira, you know um, and then we can now spread the money together for and the then, next one yeah. year then once we the property proper is paid, paid for, paid for you already know that there is already value on top of it yes. you can flip it and the, so it's easier that way so but if you if you think about it just for yourself you might feel like ah this money is too much the but power, by, of, the collaboration. power of collaboration so you can actually i think that that's like another um, way, way of achieving, of achieving that climbing, climbing yeah. And before you know what's happening, another three years, in fact, you start, start at like 25, 26, and another three, four years, you guys can now start doing yours separately. But you already understand how it, how works. it works and, and all of that. Um, so I think that's for me, that's the advice that I would give. Mm -hmm. I think you've spoken about collaboration. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. what other advice? Uh -huh. you are you going to give them? You will pray now. Miracle, no, they tire Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Miracle, <laughs> no, they tire Jesus. <laughs> There's nothing God cannot the, do. If the husband is not cooperating, you, uh, you, you take him take, to the Lord. Just take him to the altar. <laughs> God will do it. You know, but, you know, I mean, like, I'm saying that because I'm also a person of faith. Mm. Um, at the same time, I feel like maybe you can, that's, I'm just addressing the, People that are having difficulties, like with their like their husbands coming their on partner, board, yes. I think that you know when you communicate the value of how it will, the person or the husband will benefit from how the family, how the family benefit benefit from, from yes. and you can you don't even necessarily need to do it alone. Yes, if you get his yes, buy, yes, both of yes, you can, both do, of it can do it together. Exactly. Mm. So I think that 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 should solve that and then for people are thinking maybe when you start doing it together yes, you will not yes, start yes, losing maybe, enough yes, and you can yes, now have yes, your way yes, to do to for your exactly, own exactly exactly so i think that that can work mm. even though i don't know really some men say have coconut head sha but yeah, you know even women so, everybody, everybody has, has coconut, coconut head, head so, so you, you know have you have to find <laughs> cracking the <laughs> cracking is more small eventually to anyways yeah so that's for that part then i also say that um for ladies young ladies that feel like if i buy a house if i buy a car you know i would think that i'm too much and all of that i again i'm of the opinion that please like do you like don't allow anybody you know to box to box you right do you like do you basically you never can tell what if you eventually even find the person and that's what that's that's what the, that's the quality that the person actually looking for. looking for right so it's a win-win and if the person feels threatened then you know that there are deeper that's layers not, yes. to this and maybe it's either you're conversing about it exactly or you're taking exactly, a walk. exactly 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 mm. and also you also need to look inwards as well and i'm not trying not that i'm trying to blame the woman or anything but you know mm. how some people can just be trying to load it over load it over without, so even, without knowing. even knowing mm. right so um check mm. but aside from that if everything being equal i would say please go for it if you don't have to buy 10 houses before the marriage please yes, by, all, by means. all means do it and you know live your life it's for the family and everybody would be so fine. all these are our young girls that mm. are always uh, you know you are a travel <laughs> blogger now <laughs> hey, hey Mo, travel, travel blogger, blogger i went for one speaking engagement last week and they introduced me as a travel, blo oh. travel blogger the <laughs> convener had to run and carry mic and say she's not a travel blogger <laughs> no. i say see my it's life part of your bio. <laughs> i know we i know i know bio. Mm, if yes, we, if yes. you yes. go to morale <laughs> people on his page you'll be you inspired see, 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 she has a target how many countries she wants to visit it yes, at a time. particular time yes, yes yes so um you know it, it it's it's one of the in things mm -hmm. and people always just go with flows and trends mm -hmm. so lifestyle 
you know is in now mm -hmm. to live and show mm -hmm. lifestyle mm -hmm. so for those young girls who mm -hmm. are actually seeing this money making mm -hmm. this money mm -hmm. you know we kind of um with the work that they do mm -hmm. some do influencing mm -hmm. some do you know mm -hmm. they are seeing the money mm -hmm. but they are not investing mm -hmm. in real estate mm -hmm. what are you going to say to ha them? hey like it's for me i don't think that so many of them actually yes. feel that they are too young Ha, uh, now is the time because I know that I'm a prophet of doom or anything, but you never can tell what will happen tomorrow, right? But this is what, in fact, even in the Bible, where Joseph, God, God had told Joseph that he should plan, there will be seven years of plenty, seven years of famine. It happens. We check our, even our economies, Nigeria, America, there would always be that, those years of plenty and then the years of recession. Mm -hmm. It always happens. Like, mm -hmm. whether you pray for it or everywhere you don't pray for it. Everywhere in the world. Everywhere in the world, it happens. So, what are you doing in the years of plenty? plenty. You need to be taking, like, your 20%, your 30% where you are saving in the barn, such that when you now get to the years of famine in quotes, you are not even feeling it because it's like, I mean, and so that, that's that's why you have the target of one yes. house every yes, year one now. Year. Yes, so yes, yes. In the next ten years, you have at least how many houses? At least, at least fifteen houses. At least. Ooh. Drum roll, drum roll, Ooh. drum roll. Drum roll. <laughs> that's it. Do you understand? So, yeah. you, so um, you do that, right? Because you just never can tell. And I would say, so for me, I didn't really start. I mean, this year is my tenth year in business. It wasn't like I started this lifestyle thing in my year one or my year two. I've worked like year one, year two. Uh, there are so when you are seeing more, you can see, know that I've done ten years. Where, and there's this way I will leave the house and I will get out. I realized and went to the different legs of bathroom slippers. This morning that I have seen and I is slain. If you see something like seven years ago, in my my world that quite because at that time I was just focused on building the business. This is what it was about. All this lifestyle, blah blah blah. It wasn't even in my dictionary at the time. It was work, work, work. So now I'm still working, but now you know there is you built a structure, I built a structure around, around it and all of that. So if I'm traveling today, it's not like oh I'm taking money yeah, from, from my Ocantic. from Ocantic's business. That the business that. I'm not planning to be top 10 in the country, in that industry. I'm not planning to be on Forbes list. My own is, I want to, I wake up, oh, Which I country? want to go to is Paris. So is it Bali or, Sally or, or Tali, Tali or, or Mali Nelly or Pili? <laughs> Okay, no problem. There's a business that is funding it. I usually like to do this with yes. um, <laughs> all those that I speak to mm -hmm. on um, not too young to invest in mm -hmm. real estate mm -hmm. um, campaign. So, your house, when you bought that house, mm -hmm. can you remember how much you bought your house? It was, say, 45. 45 million. Do you know what it's going for now? I'm hearing that. I don't think it's, well, it's not even up to a year, right? No, it's not up to you. When I finish paying for it, I think in August or so. Do you know how much it's going for now? I shall know that's above 50 million share. <laughs> okay, so I want to return your money now and collect my house back. <laughs> what are you collecting me for? <laughs> that's my baby. Me and you would just, I would not, want to go and collect for everybody. everybody. <laughs> we are going to go to court and go and challenge this mandate that you want to collect from my hand. Thank you so much <laughs> for sharing with us Thank your, you so much. Your, Thank your real estate story mm -hmm. and your journey into real estate mm -hmm. investing. It is beautiful to see mm -hmm. and you know, you're young mm -hmm. and you're doing it and that is what we're trying to say here. You don't need to have all the money mm -hmm. in the bank. Mm -hmm. You don't need to be old mm -hmm. because a lot of people have the mentality that it's for old people. Mm -hmm. You don't need to be old. You don't need to have all the money mm -hmm. in the bank. Mm -hmm. You know, all those things that you use as excuses, trust me, from what you have heard, mm -hmm. down excuses. Mm -hmm. So all you need, mm -hmm. she said, is to make up your mind, right? That's, that's the starting point. All you need, all we always need for everything yeah is to say okay i'm gonna do this <laughs> and then where the money will come from mm. the holy so spirit that's the most <laughs> the holy spirit will provide and, will and no you you have to work yeah you have to work yeah. you know that one you have to actually so once work. you have a target yeah. you set your mind to it mm -hmm. you put in the work mm -hmm. the money will come yeah you just first make up your mind mm -hmm. you are not too young to invest in real estate so please make up your mind today <laughs>